Silicon gel has been used in hospitals for decades to treat and prevent scarring. It is now available over the counter, but how does silicon gel work on scars? First, we have to start with how scars form. When a wound or break in the skin occurs, signals are sent by the body to repair the injury. Injuries are repaired by specialized fibroblast cells sent to the wound site to produce collagen, a fibrous tissue, and a scar is formed. It is believed that silicon gel works by modifying scar formation properties. The initial action of silicone gel is to occlude or seal the scar. Occlusion helps to prevent dehydration of the wound. This dehydration signals to fibroblast cells to continue to create collagen. Too much collagen production, however, can result in thick, raised, unsightly scars. By keeping the scar hydrated, the body sends fewer signals to the wound, creating less scar tissue. Unlike other methods of scar sealing, silicon gel provides optimal permeability to maximize oxygen transfer across the surface of the skin. This enhances wound healing. Silicon gel also helps transfer tension from the edges of the wound to the silicon itself. With the silicon absorbing the tension, the forces that normally create a more widened scar are reduced. Silicon gel also reduces the redness of the scar by preventing the creation of new tiny blood vessels. Finally, it is believed silicone creates a negative static field which aligns and organizes the collagen fibers in a more uniform pattern. The negative field also tends to pull in or cause the involution of raised scars. In summary, occlusion, tension transfer, decreased capillary activity, and collagen alignment from silicone treatment may result in enhanced scar healing.